Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be sharing this very festive Halloween night with you all. For tonight, I'll be doing a couple fun Halloween activities that will hopefully get you guys inspired to do the same. And if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up if you guys would like to see more Halloween content like this. Anyways, without further ado, let's hop right into this video. So on this particular night, I had already cleaned the kitchen and picked up the mess that I accumulated during the day. The last thing that I that needed to be done in the house was to vacuum, so I went ahead and did just that. Once I was finally ready to wind down and relax, I made myself a nice cup of hot chocolate. And if you've been following me for a while, you know that usually I will do coffee at night, but a lot of you have been like going crazy on me being like, oh my God, why are you drinking coffee at night? <laughs> so this time I decided to opt for some hot chocolate, which actually was really, really good. Um, but yeah, that's what I did tonight. And then I did end up adding a little bit of sugar since it ended up being a little watered down for me. And then of course, as always, I topped it off with some whipped cream and some very, very festive sprinkles. And one of you did suggest to give Cool Whip a try, which is like the like container version of the whipped cream and i've been trying to find it in stores but for some reason it's sold out everywhere so i really hope that i run into it sometime soon all right so first thing i wanted to do tonight was to be able to make a really cute boo basket for my toddler he is a year and a half now which is crazy but um, he's still small and I tried to add things that basically I knew that he loved that he could play with. So I added some keychain plushes, um, some snacks, some cereal and um, a bath toy and just stuff that was very Halloween and festive for him. And um, the keychain plushes that I actually added in this boo basket, I'm gonna be hanging on his little backpack that I'm gonna be buying for him. We are planning a Disneyland trip, which I'm very excited about. So if you don't wanna miss out on that video, then definitely subscribe because I will be vlogging our entire trip there. So now that that's done, I pulled out some of these Pillsbury pumpkin sugar cookies for baking and I do this religiously every single year. I just love how simple and festive they are. They're like the first thing that any Target puts out anyway for like the season. So I always pick them up the second I see them. While the oven was preheating, I took the chance to hang out with my little newborn girl. She is a month old, so yes, I have two kids. Um, and of course, uh, she decided to poop in the process, so I had to change her diaper. Um, but I hung out with her for a little bit. She was sleeping in her um, little like bassinet thing. It's called a, um, what is it called? A Snuggle Me Organic. And I will link that for you guys below if you are interested. But anyways, I went ahead and changed her diaper and then we hung out, I fed her, and I was just waiting for the oven to preheat so I could put the cookies back in. And now that the cookies were baking, I wanted to really watch a movie that wasn't one that I'd seen before. And one of those Halloween movies is Hocus Pocus. I've never seen this one and I really wanted to watch it this year. So um, I went ahead and played that one and um, my baby girl, her name is Kira and she was just really colicky. She was having some stomach pains. So I was walking around a little bit while I was watching the movie, um, just kind of giving her in a hold. It's called a colic hold for you guys that don't have kids. Um, but basically this helps her tummy ache. So I was holding her like that, watching the movie, and then once I was able to calm her down, I walked over to the built-in. I pulled out my very festive Halloween blanket 
because that one is also one that I pull out every single year. I love it. I've had it for a while. So I pulled that out and then I went and sat down at the couch and just relaxed for a little bit, watched the movie, and waited for the cookies to be ready to, to take out of the oven. So now that the cookies are ready, I pulled them out and let them cool down for a little bit. I went back to the couch, sat down, scrolled through my phone a little bit on Pinterest, trying to get inspiration for Christmas. Um, it's very, very early. We're literally still like, it's so funny because this is literally a Halloween video and I'm looking at Christmas inspiration. <laughs> um, but you know, you're never too ready. You always have to be planning ahead. Um, but anyways, I was scrolling through my phone and then I kept watching the movie. My cat decided to join us, which is super cute. And he was actually watching the movie, which is so funny. Um, but yeah, I finished the movie. And then once that was done, it was pretty late in the night already. And I wanted to take my baby girl upstairs so she could, you know, sleep interrupted, um, uninterrupted. So I went ahead and grabbed some cookies, of course. I went over to our dining table, sat down and just started scrolling through um, a couple of Etsy shops and um, did a little bit of editing as well before I ended the night. And yeah, that's pretty much everything. It was a very, very, very relaxed night. Um, my baby boy is obviously sleeping upstairs. He wasn't with us, of course, because he falls asleep very, very early in the day, like around maybe 6 or 7 p.m. So um, once he's a little older, he'll definitely be a part of our little family routines. But for this night, it was just me and Kira, and I really loved it. So yeah, anyways, if you guys do want to see more videos like these, definitely let me know. This one is going to be the last one for Halloween though. The next one that you guys will be seeing is probably gonna be Christmas and I will be doing some day in the lives as well. Just to give you guys more inspiration for Halloween, we'll be doing some pumpkin carving and all that good stuff. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.